We can take this helpless cat, this captivating woman from our childhood, some random bouquet, and Vidu can create for us an AI video with exactly these characters. We can change the scene, add the different objects and create a consistent story. For example, make this cat walk on himself, or maybe have a small quarrel. I've never seen such instrument before. I feel like a real director, and this is blowing my mind. Hello everyone, as you might already guessed, today we're gonna talk about AI video generator Vidu, which has a lot of unique features. The link is available in the description below, let's dive in. As usual, let's start with the home page of the service, and here we should sign in or sign up. I'm gonna use Google for this purpose, so I also recommend the same for you. Alright, 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 we are the starting page of the service, and here you can find all your tools, which are available to you. It's reference to video, image to video, and text to video. There are also uh, templates and sound effects. In this video, we're gonna cover the most interesting part to me, the reference to video, because with this tool, you can create real cinematic scenes with consistent characters without any additional tools only you and your imagination. This tool works really simple. What you need for any cinematic shot. You need your actors, you need your scene, and you need your idea. This works in the same way. If you're gonna use consistent character, reference works in the best way for us. So press the references button, and we can add our reference by pressing plus button. Here uh, you can add up to three images of your reference with different angles. Mm, I think the most popular user cases here is using just one image. So let's try with this one. Let's add our main character and this will be quite unhealthy cat. Enter the name of your character, big cat, okay. The next step is description. The default one which was created automatically works really nice for me. Let's just describe your style. In my cases it will be only realistic styles, so press confirm button. And also we need to add uh, in the next uh, reference, this will be a hat of this cat. Alright, and now uh, we can also add the next thing, for example, we're gonna use an image of Tokyo for uh, creating our cinematic scene. Alright, everything is set up and we can easily create our cinematic scene right here with our references. Press the references button once again, and here you should choose your references, Tokyo, hat and big cat. Okay, and now let's enter our problem here. A giant cat standing on its uh, hind legs like Godzilla and wearing a rose hat emerges from the water to destroy Tokyo. Let's choose the model. Um, let it be Viduku1 and press create button. Uh, while this video is generating, we can generate another video with different prompt. So, also important information about reference specifying. Uh, you can specify reference in this way, quite simple and convenient, but also a more clear way to specify your reference, just drag them to any place you like. And the third option, just use add symbol and choose your reference from the drop down. Alright, here is our first video. It looks really, really nice, but for some reason it's not standing on its hind legs. Alright, that looks much more impressive. Oh my god, what's going on here? But that looks really nice. And I think the best options for us to generate uh, videos with model 2.0. That looks much better and without noticeable artifacts. Even water splashes here. Alright, now we can easily substitute our cat with any reference you like. For example, let it be raccoon. So we created a raccoon reference. That's supposed to be really nice. And let's use almost the same prompt, but without hat. Raccoon should look very serious. Alright, we've got our results and they look really impressive. Only look at this. Oh my god. And the same here. Uh, it's less consistent, 
but I like this one and the second one. And let's generate the final scene, an epic battle between a cat in a ghost hat and the monster raccoon. This is gonna be very interesting and epic, so we need to just specify our references, big cat, rose hat, raccoon, and choose our model. For this case, I think we should generate, we should try two models uh, like a Q1 and 2.0 in order to compare which models works the best for us. I almost forgot to mention that there is a pearl mode, which allows you to add much more information about your generations and adjust more parameters. It's also making your prompt much better automatically. And here you can choose your parameters. Just press this button here plus and choose your style, motion level, shoot size, focal length, composition, camera angles. There are plenty of parameters and it works really, really nice. But I purposely choose the easiest user cases when you just enter your very simple, not sophisticated prompt and press create button. All right, we've got our results uh, with uh, we do 2.0 and that looks really, really <laughs> interesting. Um, there is some mm, deformation and artifacts, obviously, but the scene is very complicated. And here is one solid example. This one looks very nice and quite scary, to be honest. The newest model, uh, Vidu Q1, has uh, better quality, uh, but there is uh, less movement, I suppose. And not so, you know, cinematic. It looks quite funny, to be honest, especially this one. It's not an epic battle in a Godzilla style, but still very consistent, much more consistent than the previous one. I generated more examples and this one was, to my mind, the best one, because at the end there is a car which hits the raccoon and that looks really cinematic. Let's talk about the most important part here, it's the price. And it's surprisingly very affordable. First of all, you have free option, which allows you to generate up to 10 references per month, which is really nice. At the same time, you have a standard plan and premium plan. For the premium plan, which to my mind works the best, allows you to generate up to 1000 videos per month, and this is very, very generous. At the same time, you have a lot of premium features like 8K video generation, upscaling, high-speed channel generation, and a lot more. So I think this is a really nice service, and I can recommend it. Thanks for watching this video. I hope that you like it, and bye-bye.